Hello, my name's Stephen Wilkinson from the Compost Tea Brewing Company in Perth, Western Australia. And today I want to demonstrate to you one of our new compost tea brewers. Now, this is the, the brewer here. Now you can either make this yourself or we can supply you all the parts as well. Uh, we've actually made this um, the main purpose is you can actually make it yourself. So what the, the drum we've actually used is a, a dustbin. You get these out of Bunnings. Uh, so the bin, $20, and the stand again, about another $20. Now in the bottom of this um, bucket, we've drilled a 20 mil hole, and we've put a, a brass fitting kit. Now you will have to buy these from us, we, we sell these. There's actually four components to this, this fitting kit. This clamps to the, this goes on the bottom of the, the tank. And the most important part of our brewer is this aeration disc. Now this is a smaller, um, smaller size. We've got a bigger one for this brewer. This is the size that we we use in our 60 litre brewer, but the, the, they're basically the same. So this is a, a rubber disc, rubber membrane, and there's about 3,000, um, they're not actually holes, they're, they're needles that uh, uh, make impressions in the, in the membrane. And when you pump air through this disc, you get uh, aerated water so we're getting about 3,000 uh, micro bubbles and what we found is with this compost brewer because it fills the the complete circumference of the bottom of the tank or your whole barrel is aerated with um, air bubbles. Now to demonstrate to you the effectiveness of the the bubbles I've set up this tank I'll just plug it in So you can see the aeration that's produced by the disc. Now when this is in the brewer, we have the tea bag in the centre of the um, of all the aeration. So you're gonna get that agitates the, the compost inside the bag. So what I'll do, I'll I'm gonna make up a, a brew now for this brewer and I'll turn it on and I'll show you how it works. Okay, so I'll just turn that off. Okay, so we've got a, a 60 litres of, of water. Now I've let this settle for over 24 hours. Um, you need to do that to um, that rids the, the water of all the chlorine, which is most important. Or you can run, just run the pump for an hour and that removes all the chlorine from the water. Now we've got our compost tea bag. These are a, a specially made um, nylon mesh bag with uh, <coughs> the hole is the important size, it's 400 microns. Now that size allows the compost to be inside the bag and one, when the water's being aerated, it agitates the bag and the compost, sorry, the microbes are then released from the compost into your, your brew. Now, a 60 litre brew, you put about 500 grams of compost. Now it's very important the quality of compost. So this is an organic certified compost. Um, you can make your own compost, um, but this is a very good high quality uh, compost. So that goes into the center of the bag. Now we've actually got a Velcro seal 
the top of the bag and that's suspended in the, in the middle of the, the brewer. Into this you put your fish hydrosylate. Now what the purpose of this is, it's actually, this feeds the microbes. So when your microbes are coming out of your compost, the fish hydrosylate, that's what they feed on and that's what uh, multiplies your, your microbes. And then we add to 60 uh, litres, this is the 100 uh, mil of kelp, of sea kelp. Again, we, we do sell the additives as well on our website. Now we use a, a 60 litre Haley branded air pump. General rule of thumb with these brewers is you match the capacity of your, your brewer to the uh, capacity of your pump. So a 60 litre um, pump, will, well it's a 60 litre bucket, we've got about 50 litres in here. Um, you can buy your own pump, uh, but we do recommend we use these. The, we've got a, a two year warranty on these pumps um, and they're quite uh, low noise and they're very energy efficient as well. So I'll just pump, turn this pump on now. So you can see the effectiveness of the, the bubbler. <coughs> now that compost has been agitated by, the, uh, by those 3,000 uh, micro holes. Uh, another important feature of this brewer is because the, the aeration disc covers the complete bottom of the tank, uh, you don't get any... Um, any pockets of air that are not being um, <coughs> agitated by the air so you don't get and it doesn't go anaerobic now we also have a if you buy the brewer from us it comes with a ventilation plate on the top you can just put that on your brewer now as you can hear the pumps very very quiet <coughs> um, now what we do sell is the um, the aeration kits on their own so if you do want to make your own brewer if you want to save a bit of money we've got a we call it a BYO bring your own brewer kit so we've got the all important um, 400 micron mesh compost tea bag <coughs> we've got the aeration discs in two sizes uh, it's a 270 mil or a 360 mil we've got a 360 mil in this one and this comes also comes with the, the fitting kit. All you need then is to supply your own pump and your vessel or and stand. <coughs> or we we sell the we also sell the pumps as well. So we've got a selection of uh, we've got a, a 40, a 60, an 80, and a 120 litre um, air pumps. So depending on the size of your vessel, you then match your pump. Um, so that's about about it really. Uh, if you want to do do want to purchase the brewer outright, you can go to our website and we've got a section of uh, of compost tea brewers, and you also find the accessory kits in on the website as well. So that's uh, composttbrewing.com.au. Thank you for watching today.